Welcome back to another super cool soupy fight video. Today we're gonna be sh I'm gonna be showing off my Wii U console, which is modded. Showing you guys what I've done to it. And if you guys have been paying attention to the Speed Code Industries YouTube channel, you will know how I've been able to do some of this stuff. And today I'll be showing off what I have on here. And then maybe on the Speed Code Industries channel, I will be showing you guys how to get some of the stuff I have on there. Now Let's get into it. All right, we're on the Wii U. Now you might be wondering, where's the modding stuff? That's because this is the base of the Wii U. Give me a second to go insert the homebrew SD card. All right, here are my themes. We got the Enzo Galaxy, Minecraft. The speaker one, I'm still working on. We're gonna go select the Enzo Galaxy. Here's the main menu. There's my me. There's me. He looks exactly like me. Here comes everybody. So this is the Mario Galaxy theme. No. Hold on. I gotta go fix the thing. Cause it looks goofy on the computer. There we go. It might not be perfect full screen. But we're gonna have to deal with this today. But yeah. This is the TV screen. When you go and open up Homebrew. On the SD. My SD card. At least with the um, the Enzo Galaxy thing. All right, on the gamepad we got Mario Party 10, Curse Return to Dreamland, Sonic and Black Knights, Sonic and Secret Rings, Cinder Adventure 2, Cinder Adventure 1, and Sonic Heroes. Now these are obviously cover edited, as you can see, since Cinder Adventure and Cinder Adventure 2 don't exist. At least not yet. I haven't made them. These are just like little funny ROMs that I've made. I'll show you guys in a future video what it is. So, that's pretty much the gamepad and the Wii U menu. We're not going to play Wii U game for right right now. In this next video I'm going to release, we're not playing Wii U. We're going to be not we're going to be playing Wii Sports Resort. But let's go open up the Wii menu. Let's go and select TV only. So that's the only thing that's going to pop up on the capture card. A few moments later. All righty, we're on the Wii. Look at all these wands that I've been able to install. And now we're gonna go look at the homebrew channel, which is where everything has started on the BB. And as you can see, nothing's on the SD card when you look at it in the Wii menu. But if we can go over here to USB Loader GX. Now we're gonna get some progress because this is where everything's gonna live. It's technically a second Wii menu, but for loading stuff on your SD card. Which is why it's called USB Loader GX. So and this may look like just a little bit of games and look like everything that was already on the Wii menu, like the news channel and stuff. But we actually had to go into our settings here and go enable wait this is the wrong menu also in case you guys were wondering this is my wii u that's in my living room at another location and the one that i'm probably going to swap between is at another location and this is the setup for that one compared to the one in the living room okay so we go over here and then we select Wii games, turn on. Yeah, we have all my backups. We got cars, on colors, and Wii Sports and Wii Sports Resort. Look at that. Look how beautiful this is. We got Sonic Color, Sonic Colores, as I like to call it. And we also got Wii Party. Amazing, right? It's utterly amazing. It's just amazing. And just like I said, we got Mater's Star Tales. And yeah, that's pretty much my that's pretty much the whole mod Wii U. If you guys enjoy this and were wanting to see the tutorials, I'll have links to them. And be ready for the Wii Sports video. See ya!
Oh, 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 oh,